How is it going, my friends? It is my absolute honor and absolute pleasure to present to you our brand new short-term rental in Minneapolis proper and beautiful neighborhood. A truly amazing, special, unique neighborhood in Minneapolis known as Cedar Isles Dean. And this is a place that we have poured ourselves into, we've obsessed over, and really tried to make it something special, something unique, something calming, peaceful, and inspiring. How's it going, my friends? My name is Jesse Lynch, and I run a company called Made Rare. You can check out our website, maderare.com. We are a short-term rental management partnership and consultation company, and we focus on making, creating truly special spaces for investor clients, for our partners, and for our guests. This YouTube channel is here for you, hosts and aspiring short-term rental hosts, as a well of knowledge of different information and techniques and I don't know, thoughts that we've acquired. So if any of that appeals to you, do me a favor, do yourself a favor, subscribe to this channel and click the little bell so you can get notified every time we put out a video just like this one. If you wouldn't mind, give the video a thumbs up. It's so helpful to this channel, but also to other people like yourselves who are looking for this kind of information. But I just can't wait to get started and show you around this beautiful place that we've created for our guests, the place between the lakes. Again, I said earlier that the place between the lakes is in the Cedar Isles Dean neighborhood of Minneapolis, which is truly a special neighborhood. It's nestled between three of the most beautiful lakes in all of the Twin Cities, Bedamacoska, Lake of the Isles, and Cedar Lake. And everything that we've done with the experience of this house is to make it something special. As you pull into the neighborhood and as you turn on to the tree-lined street and stand in front of the property, I think you will see that it's going to be a special experience and you as a guest are being taken care of. From the front yard, you'll see a beautiful, simple stucco structure and you'll see an attention to detail in the landscaping. We have raised garden beds, three of which contain wildflowers, which we pick and give to our guests. And you'll see along the side of the house, we have raised bed vegetable gardens. Again, we are happy to share these vegetables with our guests. And just outside the front door, another raised bed containing spices and herbs, which are available for use, again, by anybody staying at the place between the legs. You'll open the front door, grab your key, open the door to the unit, and we really believe and put our full intention on designing an experience. So you open the door and you realize that this space is immaculate, is inspiring, and is waiting for you and you alone to enjoy. attention to detail everywhere in every single space of the home. A combination of one-of-a-kind vintage pieces and updated high-end furniture. In the living room, you'll be greeted by a Scandinavian designed couch, beautiful, so comfortable. And you'll also see a Samsung The Frame TV that has a photo that I took from somewhere around the world. You'll see dozens of plants around the space that have been meticulously cared for and are truly thriving in that environment. Vintage pieces from around the country, around the globe. From a mid-century turquoise chair in the living room from the original 3M building in Minnesota to a Scandinavian-inspired vintage bench from a factory in St. Louis, Missouri. You'll have access to music. You can play the acoustic guitar hung on the wall, which is not just beautiful art, but is playable and in tune. There's a 1960s spinet piano with blonde wood. It is not just a beautiful piece of art or an item of decor. It's a playable piano that sounds truly wonderful resonating throughout the house. There are arched nooks which are built into the wall. They'll contain interesting old books and antique decor. There's a beautiful painting in the living room of a meadow. And that painting was collected by a naval pilot pre-Vietnam War somewhere in Europe. He said Spain or France, he doesn't remember. 
You have a Scandinavian inspired dining room table that comfortably seats six under a Scandinavian pennant. And as you walk into the kitchen, you will see a truly beautiful updated kitchen that is fully stocked and still maintains that beautiful character. A blend of charm and convenience with handmade wooden poles and updated luxury appliances. You'll have two bedrooms, both of which have a queen size bed, ample closet space for any guest, and a full bathroom that truly mixes eras beautifully. And as you walk to the back of the kitchen and through the French doors, you'll find yourself on a custom cedar deck that is absolutely stunning in a backyard of your dreams. Modern outdoor L-shaped sofa, hugs a privacy fence. The custom cedar deck is accented with foliage like Carl Forrester grass and also a Frontenac grapevine running up the privacy fence. And even though Minnesota is known for its fresh water, the backyard is lined with a decomposed granite which requires very minimal water use to maintain. There's a primitive cedar dining table in the backyard with seating for eight, as well as a two-seater bistro set so you can catch shade at different times of the day. In addition to the grapevines, we planted two native apple trees and one native peach tree in the backyard. And if you find that or anything else makes you hungry, we have a Traeger wood pellet grill available for guest use. And because we strive to make your stay as flawless as possible, we have a one car stall garage parking with opener available for guests and laundry available at all times. Some of the extra little touches that we provide, we don't even want to tell people publicly. We want them to be surprises for guests as they walk in. officially three months into being listed on short-term rental websites, and we have been booked just about fully solid with the exception of a few days. We hit superhost status within two months, and we truly have been striving for nothing but five-star reviews every single time. And it's about a lot more than a number on Airbnb or VRBO. It is truly about the satisfaction of our guests who put their faith in what we've created to give them a special experience at the place between the lakes. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I can't wait to show you a more before and after look at what we did to the space. And, and I look forward to sharing more and more videos with y'all about all things short-term rentals. All right, y'all, my name is Jesse Lynch. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you subscribe to the channel and watch the next video that pops up. All right, bye-bye.